Five, four, three, two, one. How's it hanging? Hey, welcome back again. That's fucking week flying. Unbelievable. So, like, what's new? What's going on? Welcome, nation. Mm -hmm. uh, peace and love. Beautiful weather. Start going on. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Let's get this rock and rolling up. Red Sting rock and rolling in Nashville. Yeah. Uh, facing extinction, but available for selfies in Japanese animal cafes. Selfies extinction? There's animals. Yes. That are on the brink of extinction. In the selfies? No. Like, in the world. Why is it selfies extinction? Because there's cafes. Yeah. In Japan. Okay. That offer these extinct animals you could go hang out with them and, and drink a coffee with them and then they stare at you so they have a wide why did i know of it yeah so it says here critical endangered species and ones banned from international trade are among the hundreds of types of birds reptiles and mammals that researchers identified so how big is this at stuff? At 142 animal cafes total. Holy fuck, who cleaned the shit over there? So there's 142 animal cafes in Japan. Yeah, this is that the... all have different species of extinct animals. The first is like a crispy cricket. <laughs> the crispy cricket, okay. Then it's a grasshopper with three legs. Okay. Then we have the beetle. With one eye. <laughs> <laughs> it's a stink beetle, yeah. yeah the, the one eye beetle. Yeah, fucking crazy ants. The cyclops beetle. The ants who eat ants. The, what do you call, uh, cannibalistic ants. Ants that eat ants. Okay. Yeah, what do you call, cannibali? Yeah, yeah, say it one more time. <laughs> <laughs> then you have a, a, some eagles. Eagles, or okay. guys. think that. Mm -hmm. Then you have this big fucking e seagull, what do they call them? Albatross? Yeah. This guy is almost extinguished. Mm, I don't think they're extinguished, no. <laughs> no, like almost, I said. So they say <laughs> almost, yeah? Because they're still there, but yeah. not, almost not there. Uh -huh. <laughs> they're almost not there. Yeah, yeah, because that's what they say, extinguish. <laughs> <laughs> this is like fire extinguishing. Why yeah, that's what that's how you're pronouncing it, like extinguisher. Yeah, but what are you supposed to say? Extinction. Oh, this extinction. Yeah, these animals are on extinction. Oh, but why do they call fire extinguishing? What does this have to do with extinguishing? What does extinguishing mean, maybe? Extinguishing means like stopping, like like stop the fire, like extinguish the fire. So why do they not say like a fire stop it should can? The fire stoppage can? <laughs> yeah. Why do they use an extinguisher in the wind? Because it's spray. It's like a projectile that extinguishes the problem. Hmm. Let's back to the Japan fucking. We'll get yeah, it so it says here, in Japan. Yes. It It's possible to enjoy a coffee while an owl perches on your head. Or to... It's like ca cow perches in your head? Yeah, perches on your head. Like, what is how cow perches? I didn't say cow. What did you say? I said owl. Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, so how owl perches on your head? That's what they do. They like perch on trees. Like what does perch mean? Why? Why are you using this kind of fucking crazy the, words today? There's no crazy like, words. English it. Normal, <laughs> normal English. Perches. Fucking language. So this mean the cow. Owl because I'm landing owl, on your head and she purchases be, you. Because so owl, I'm by this guy. Because technically, owls don't have arms or legs. What do you mean, owls don't have legs? They have fucking, fucking unbelievable. But would claw. you say that's an arm or a leg? Leg. Crazy fucking. But they pick up shit with it. So why wouldn't you call it an arm? The claws. Yeah. Yeah. That's so a, when they're sitting on something, that means they're perched. On like a tree branch or like you know, like they landing. Y no, they're just standing. No, but they landing and standing. No, landing is like they're in flight and then they're landing. And the purchase is just does mean they they're just sitting there. 
They just hang there. Yeah. Also, oh, they hang on your head. Yeah. But you know, scared if I can put the claw in your brain. I don't know. It says here the owl can sit on your head while you're having a coffee. Because I think the owl have like, like long nails, but they have like a, like a dogs little pillows under me or cats. For not feel not feeling hot or cold, so how they can sit on the branches, they you know freeze to the branch. <laughs> okay, because me, me, I gonna freeze to the branch. Uh huh. And you're then, saying cats and dogs can walk on ice? And yeah. Freeze? See how they walking on the uh, yeah they walking on the ice with these pillows on the underneath. They call this pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's what they call it. Yeah, right? pillow feet. <laughs> yeah, that's why they no feel nothing how they're walking. Like stones and everything. It's like a like a rubber tie for them. <laughs> but uh -huh. sometimes they get cut and they're bleeding. But the, but the skin is so uh, so uh, rough and thick, 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 thick. Mm -hmm. So they no feel it. That's what they said. Like, you know, like they, like they have a cushion. That's where they can run on the stones. You can't run on the stones without your fucking shoes. You're going, ah, ah, ah. But dogs, no, look at this. Did you hear our dogs? Like, ah, 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 no. Mm -hmm. At least must be something really sharp or something. Mm -hmm. Like a field with cut flowers. Mm -hmm. But yeah, or, or the to sit at a bar where live penguins stare at you from a plexiglass wall. Oh, so they have a... Who breaks a wall, go, go wall and he's sitting in the bar and watching and uh, like not and the bar. And there's full penguins <laughs> there staring at you in the bar. That's terrible. That's worse than fucking our fucking shit when they complain about our fishes. Why is that worse? Yeah, because the fuck penguins are sitting people in plastic wall. Yeah, at least they're alive. Oh, well, we can say the same thing. At least we have a life. No, the whale died at Marine Land. Holy fuck! Did you hear it? How long she was? 40. 46. Yeah. And they supposed to release her to this, they have sanctuary for her. Yeah. Like a few more years she's supposed to go there, but because she was so depressed, she died herself. And they said she was hurting herself above the wall, mm -hmm. remind her she's still alive. That mm -hmm. was the guy said. And I'm like, oh, that's sad. Yeah, an emo whale. Why they didn't put something like, uh, you know, like, maybe divide the tank to like, not, you know, like was full tank, divide like little ant tank and put her like little fishes and everything so she have like companion over there. She would just eat them. No, no, but that's gonna be close. It will be like a, like a plastic glass in the so bar. So you're gonna taunt her. She's so, like, look at this delicious food. She said, oh my God. And she's gonna I'm smack the wall nonstop. I'm not alone anymore. Let's purpose to leave. Let's play with nanos. Like little fishes and nanos? Nanos? What are you called? Nano? What? <laughs> Nanos? <laughs> Nanos. <laughs> Rainy, Zuzu, you wanna come? What is Rainy? No. No, no, I have to close one and then like, open another one. So yeah, yeah, so keep going. Okay. It says... Oh, the, she went to the room. Okay. The country's exotic animal cafes uh -huh. are popular with locals uh -huh. as well as visitors seeking novelty, cuteness, and selfies. Mm -hmm. Customers can even buy animals at some cafes and bring them home. Oh. So you could go and buy like a three-legged owl. <laughs> How you can buy almost extinguished uh, cow and bring home? Three-legged cow? <laughs> owl. Oh, fuck, we hear cow. But it says here, but visitors of these venues may not realize that many of these cafes put wildlife conservation, their their own and public health and animal welfare at risk. It says here, in, in you can buy almost no existing animal in Japan. Yeah, you can buy an animal that is basically like one out of a hundred in the whole world from a coffee shop. How is this possible? In Japan. But how is this possible to can sell it? Because there's rules over there. What kind of animal? Giselle? <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. That's a bird, actually. That's not an animal at all. No, birds are animals. No, animals are animals. And birds are birds. 
That's what we call birds. Birds, <laughs> as animals. We have a family of animals, which is so and so, and nothing flying. <laughs> and we have birds. <laughs> hey, uh, did you see the bird tiger? Tiger, he was just walking. The <laughs> or you can say different one. Did you see this animal? Uh, fucking fly. Eagle? Yeah. No, animals that's what don't you fly. Say. No, but that's what you say. It's animals is everything. No, animals not that everything. Animals is an animals is animals who are walking on the ground. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. <laughs> then how do you explain fish? Those are animals. No, that they fish. <laughs> <laughs> it's mammals, mammals, and birds. <laughs> yeah, they got them like. Jean? No, you have to divide them, and no, you no. have reptiles and potiles. No, animals is like like rock and roll music, or music in general, and then you have the genres like rock, pop. That's like birds, no, you, fish. No, you can't you can't say animals. But it's all the music. All you're like, you're, imagine this. <laughs> hey, look at this. It's animals flying. What animals? Well, fucking uh, seagulls. That's not animal, that's beer. Run away, they're gonna correct you. Oh, hey, sorry. What is he eating? Oh, that's okay. Just forget it. It's, it's, who you, cares? So He's gonna finish for five seconds, this little plastic. Fucking. Yeah, you. but they hear it. It's okay, let them hear we it. Try to have peace and quiet. I, I, listen, let them hear something. Sometimes we don't say that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so they say, oh, it's not frozen. It's like, here's some noise. I have, okay. Hey, no, no, wait a second. Reading. Wait a second. Five seconds. Wait, I'm going to wait 20 minutes for you to say a stupid sentence? Yeah, like I say. Are hey. birds animals? <laughs> exactly, that's what I'm saying. Hey, sorry. Are birds are animals? Birds are class aviators. Like aviators? Fine. Yeah. So that's the class. Winged, deep endometrics, warm blooded, egg laying, veritably ver animals. Animals, yeah. No, but that's uh, animals. Class AVS. Yeah. Wing, winged. Pop punk. B B B uh, B Del. <laughs> endotochronics, warm blooded, warm blooded. Mm -hmm. But fucking uh, like what they? <gasps> Did you hear about this new shark they found it? In the Arctic? No. Holy fuck! He lived like 450 years! Okay. They only grow one inch per year. So if you, if you measure him, he talked to himself, he, he got a problem. Okay. And, then, and then, then they say they're going down and they're feeding on the bottom of the like uh, very Arctic and oceans. Yeah, like a bottom feeder. And he looked like almost like a bull shark. Yeah. Huge fucking thing. And they said fucking they just let's uh, let's find it this for you. Cause that was interesting. I watched on uh, some kind of news yesterday. I'm like, whoa. Mm -hmm. Because they said the sharks because <laughs> they said like why they live so long? And she said because they move so slow. Yeah, they use less energy. Yeah, that's yeah. what she said. We called them this uh lazy sharks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you see, yeah, they put baits for them, so they feed them yeah. on the bottom of whatever this is, yeah. so they can film them, mm -hmm. and you see it, Zuzu, go away, Zuzu, no, go away, we show time, move. But yeah, in an exhaustive <laughs> survey of Japan's animal cafes, stop. published earlier this year, Zuzu, stop. in the journal Conservation Science and Practice, yeah. researchers found... 3,793 individual animals belonging to one or belonging to 419 different species, 52 of them which are threatened with extinction. Nine of the exotic species they found, including the endangered slow lorius and the critically endangered radiant tortoise. So it's like a turtle? Are strictly banned from international trade, but they found these in Japanese cafes. And you can take selfies with them. I'm gonna look up the other animal, that fucking slow Leoris. 
So you are, you are a slow anus. Mm-hmm. Let's see. So we have a quick slow. Wait. Leor. Wait. I have to find the slow chart. So this animal, you could go to a Japanese cafe. Hello. Lazy shark. Hello. This is the oh, animal. Oh, that's like New York Giant. <laughs> it's an extinct animal. Yeah, look at this beautiful guy. Oh. Slowly or See, why wouldn't you want to go to a coffee shop and hang out with this thing? Yeah, I'm slowly hang out with him. Yeah, he's slow. But that's fucking like, they like in Australia more, I think. So. Ooh, stop it. No, they said they found this animal in a Japanese cafe. Oh. You could take a picture with it. And hang out with it. And rare tortoises. And it's crazy how they sell them, too. It says, some species we saw are very questionable origins. It says, now a veterinarian and wildlife biologist at the National Museum of Natural History in Paris who conducted the study as a postdoctoral researcher what are we doing different Kyoto. story now i'm talking about the same shit you fucking so why in a friend from japan i'm talking about the person who did the study that went to every single japanese cafe and to they... find these endangered extinct animals but but they know cooking them no yeah, they're cooking people with them. they're just there as like decoration like a chandelier instead they have a fucking tortoise <laughs> walking around there were penguins behind plastic. Yeah, walls. they have penguins walking around, owls flying around, fucking tortoises. So what is this restaurant called? They're all over the place. No, but There's they have... There's 142 of them. Yeah, I know, but what kind of name they have? Like, if they have french fries, what are they called? Well, let's look up names of Japanese animal cafes. We'll see. Yeah, because they should have the same Japanese. name. So you can find them. Maybe they in Thailand. And you can go there. No, this is in Japan. <laughs> I'm talking about fucking Japan. I know, but maybe someone say, oh, we can do it in Thailand. American. In Thailand, you have tigers to lose one. Eleven. <laughs> right away on Google. Eleven guilt free animal cafes in Japan and Tokyo. Okay. Okay, we got Dog Heart is the name of Dog the cafe. Yeah. We got one called Python Cafe. Python Cafe. Python. Yeah, it was Python. It was... I'm not saying Python. It sounds like I'm saying Python. Python. <laughs> There's not such a thing, Python. It's Python what, Cafe. What kind of animals in Python? It's a Python probably cafe. They have like <laughs> no. Python scanning on the show. Me Pig Cafe. See the Me Pig. Megu Guro. Meguro. Yeah, America Mora Snake Cafe. <laughs> America Mora Cafe. <laughs> Snake, Snake Mora. That's hanging there. Small Animal Cafe Rockstar. Uh, one is called Luther. Moff. And one is called Harry Wood. <laughs> in, in Osaka. Oh, Harry Wood. Yeah, yeah. that's what they like, uh, <laughs> calling my name or something. <laughs> I got other names here. We got the Owl Cafe and Bar Owl Village. Wow, that's the amazing name. Penguin Bar Ikabukoro. See? That sounds Japanese. Yeah, yeah. what about uh, White Shark uh... <laughs> Soup? <laughs> <laughs> Nazi Soup. But yeah, there's these crazy cafes you could go check out in Japan. No. That's crazy. And so what, you feed them? Like you look, you fucking go, have a coffee, you hug a well, flamingo. flamingo. <laughs> you hug a flamingo. How does even this... Look it, in Japan... No, 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 but I understand. How does even the fucking... You know, the people who take care of animals, they love this they shit. Said, they said the real question is how the fuck did these cafe owners were able to buy, like, flamingos oh, fuck. You go in Japan. Japan. No, no, but you go to Miami, you grab flamingos. You know, it says here, in Japan, exotic animal cafes are popular with locals as well as visitors, customers. I know how they're doing. They go to Miami, they steal eggs, <laughs> then they 
put this eggs to the chicken, the chicken sit on the eggs, then baby flamingo coming, <laughs> and he thinking he's chicken, and then he need hug. See, look, like yeah. you sit, and there's a window, and then you got fancy parrots that's, in the window. No, but look at fucking who's sitting by the table. That's not a real owl. No, that's a real owl. Doesn't she perch, like perch, perch. An it. owl brought to the table for customers so yes. they can touch it, touch it and Animal Cafe yeah. in Tokyo, Japan. They glue it her feet to the, to the... See, and look, like you see, you got a ferret on your lap. Is it alive? It's a ferret. Where is it on the top? Rabbit? No, that's her t-shirt. This is a rabbit. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? It says here, officials at Japanese Minister of the Environment... Did not respond <laughs> to requests for comments. <laughs> yeah, talking about Japan, something popped up to my brain just now. Okay. It was shocking for me. What I listened last well, the last week somewhere on the news was, they said the Japan man no want to get married with woman. Yeah, okay. They said fucking they won't be free. They said they don't want to fucking splitting their fucking money. They don't want to go nowhere with them. They want to uh, use the daytime on their own. Yeah. Zushu, no. Come here. Zushu. So sure, sit, good boy. And then, and then, uh, and that's kind of man in Japan called vegetarians. Mm -hmm. Go check, vegetarians, man in Japan. I don't care. I'm no, no, but that's telling you the prices for what they're selling the animals for at the coffee shops. I think so you're wrong selling animals. I think so you... I have it right here. 38 of the cafes also offer options for buying the animals they display. Owls primarily you could buy, but also species as diverse as sugar gliders. What do you mean sugar gliders? There's an animal. It's called a sugar glider. You've never seen a sugar glider? It's no. like a little mini flying squirrel. You know my phone is useless. For that. <laughs> you have to show So me. you can see... Sugar okay. gliders? <laughs> sugar gliders. You Where's... can buy them at pet stores here. Hey, hey, Suri. Show me the picture of a sugar gliders animal. Oh. They're like oh, little they... flying squirrels. Yeah. Look. Yeah, they're like tiny and they can fly like everywhere. Oh yeah, they have like, a, they like squirrels but they have this fucking thing. So they're like, woo! Yeah. Like so these you guys could... who use the suits for flying too. So you could buy them for 150 to $300 each from the cafe. And then you eat them. No, you don't eat them. <laughs> How do you know? You can buy ba ball pythons. See, here you go, ball. Ball pythons. Chickens of ball. Yeah. From $455 to $1,290. You could buy uh, secretary birds. I don't even know what that is. Yeah. But they cost $20,000. See, in my restaurant, you can hack the... Uh, American bullies. You can also buy a red-tailed black cockatoo for tw the low price of $23,000. Oh, here you can buy red uh, racket uh, penis uh, uh, fucking American bully. We have for sale. So, it much? says here some, some of the species were of particular concern, including the critical endangered ones such as a pancake tortoise they found. Pancake tortoise. I don't even know what a pancake tortoise is. And the Central American River Turtle. Others of question origins were the Bengal Slow Leorises, the Sunda Slow Leorises, and then they found... They basically found the whole world of animals in cafes in Japan. Holy like, fuck. Look what? at this. The fucking flamingo's at the window waiting yeah, for you. Yeah, like, you're like, let me free. <laughs> and the owl's like, don't yeah. kill yourself. You're yeah. going out. I'm going to snap my neck. Oh, I can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> but they probably, they put them... Look, you get the big fucking turtle. Yeah, they very they can live to a long time. Like three, the, the oldest turtle is how much now? Like 300, 400 years? The oldest turtle? Yeah. Remember we talk about this guy? Mm. He is like 800 years. He was like on a picture since 1900 and now he's still living somewhere. In some zoo. We have here uh, Jonathan the tortoise. Yeah, how old is he? The oldest known living land animal in the world. He hatched in 1832. See? 
And is now 190 years old. Yeah, yeah, that guy. Yeah, yeah. I remember they were showing on TV him. Yeah. He's kind of big guy. It says here, Jonathan is blind. Well, that's not good. And has no sense of smell. But his hearing is great. <laughs> How do they know he hears if he's blind? <laughs> yeah, they're like, come here, Jonathan. And the turtle goes, ah. But he saw before. <laughs> yeah, he's not cowboys in the 1800s. <laughs> he's like, what's his iPhone? Fucking, <laughs> <laughs> what's going on today? <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, fuck it, that's crazy. You could go to Japan and buy 20 grand tortoises. It's fucking. That's crazy. Crazy. Holy that's me right now in the show. We rock and roll. What the fuck you doing? A uh, private thing for my channel. <laughs> Group Nagaki, the best channel on the planet. Well, you want more Japan news? Well, I got another Japan story. Okay. Japan aims to ra raise... Yeah. I almost said rage. I don't even know why. To raise age of consent from 13 to 16. They have 13 rage for sex? Yeah. So the age before in Japan to have sex with someone was 13. Find out the, 13. the man who no one be mad at. And they, now it, they raised it to 16 in a sex crime overhaul. I don't know what that means. Oh, they probably fucking uh, raping the young kids. It says here, a panel of the Japan Japanese Justice Ministry has proposed raising the age of consent from 13 to 16. It forms part of a wider overhaul of Japan's laws on sex crimes after multiple rape accusations in 2019 caused an outcry. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, thank you, you understand that. Well, a bunch of, say, like, 13, 14 year olds yeah, rape get you. fucked by like a 30 year old oh. and they're like, you raped me and then they go... They don't have the same what we have? Like, and they, you can't be so old have uh, sex with the minor? No, they the only... law is 13 and older. <laughs> no, Anyone no, but, you want. No, 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 but you can't you can't even here you can't be so old between the younger and the... Let's say she's 18, you can't be fucking... 40? Yes, you can. No, you can. Yes, you can. Or 16. 16, you can get married in Canada. Yeah, to no, anyone you want. No, they said you can be older more than five years. No. <clears throat> if you're like young in area, this thing. You know, no, no, some rules, trust me. I remember in States, they get arrested for this. If the guy is like too old and have a young girlfriend. Leonardo DiCaprio, fucking 48 years old, dating a 19 year old. No, it was always 22, he said. She was 19. He's 47. J he's, he's sick. Jake Gyllenhaal. He's like 49. His girlfriend's 20. You have a new girlfriend? He's always dating 20-year-olds. Jen Carrigan? Yeah. No, he was... Jake like, Gyllenhaal. No, they said just on the whole world. He said he have a new girlfriend and it's okay. Yeah, 19. No way she's 19. Check it out. Yeah, I'm telling you. No, you're, you're wrong with him. I don't think so. Jake. Really. I think so. There's other guys that are right there, But Jane Gyllenhaal is not right there. Jake Gyllenhaal's 42. Yeah. And his girlfriend. Because I know his sister will be no allowed this. No, no. That's the only DiCaprio make this stupid shit like that. Oh, his girlfriend is 26 years old. That's what I'm saying. And he's 42. Yeah, but I'm saying not 19. He don't do this shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. How she look like? Show me. She looks like uh, Show me. like a twenty-six year old. Is she's actress? I don't know. I think so. I know this face from somewhere. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> I just want to go to Japan restaurant and pet the flamingo. And an owl staring at me. I gotta affect you. <laughs> That'd be so much fun, like to go to a cafe. Get a coffee, and you just stare like full fucking flamingos walking around you. Or have a tiger coming and sit on And licking you. And, and your balls. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, calm down, Bangle. Calm down, Bangle. <laughs> Leave me alone, fucking. 
<laughs> Holy fuck, I don't know. Yeah, that's not a that's not a toy. Well, not a toy. But it says here the proposal also aims to criminalize the grooming of minors and expand the definition of rape. The the st- statute of limitations for reporting rape will also be increased to fif- from to fifteen from ten years. It says currently Japan has the lowest age of consent in developed countries and the lowest in the G7 group. In Germany and Italy, the age is 14. In Greece and France, the age is 15. In the UK and many US states, it's 16. <laughs> what are you smiling at? Can I help you? Yeah. Goofy? Huh? It says here, the current... I don't want to you. I love you. I love you. Uh, I'm 17. I'm going to rape the sex. What's up? Huh? We're going to put you in a Japanese cafe. People can take pictures. Of you. No music. No music. Well, who say what music? Okay, it says the current law in Japan means victims of rape need to prove that they were was violence and intimidation used during the rape. Oh, just now it's like if you rape them nicely and slowly, you okay? Yeah. Look like it's you, you can be violent. I smack you with bamboo stick. Yeah. Yeah. Can you, you, you smell delicious? You know. Did you wash yourself today? You smell like big kielbasa. <laughs> I know. <laughs> come here. Sushio, come here. You, you sit. Okay, you so good boy. Come on. It says the panel has not changed this wording, mm-hmm. but instead added other factors, including intoxication, drugging, being caught off guard and phys- physicology oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. control into the definition. So this wasn't even in the law. What? Before. Like That's crazy. Like what, drugging what? a thirteen year old and having sex with them, they're like, that's okay. No can you give Now they have to change it saying it's not okay. No wonder the fucking people from Japan look fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Yeah, they're all fucking like some kind of Fucking problem, Howard. Yeah. At they, one point, they, look at this. They have this park. They have to go hang themselves. They had a listen. Think about it. Yeah. Why? Because they get raped all the time violently. Sure. And then even then they, they don't even go to a restaurant and hug the flamingo after. Yeah, they can make their day better by going to hug a flamingo. And they go to the penis fucking carnival. Yeah, the penis festival. Walking themselves in their head. Yeah. <laughs> Think about it. And Japan's then, the uh, amazing and, country. And the best fucking thing. And the Godzilla coming from fucking Auschwitz. Mm-hmm. I don't know what they're smoking there, but they fucking have a creative fucking brain. I remember my ha Godzilla. Godzilla. Mega Godzilla. Mega Godzilla. Godzilla. Mega Godzilla was this like fucking Lulu have a spike nose. Mega Godzilla have like fucking r- rackets in their hands. Was shooting. <laughs> Godzilla was normal. Okay. And then there was a turtle. Tira 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 oh do ra re tira ri. That's remember that was very popular fucking. That was that set where I finished watching the Japanese fucking thing. Because the guy have turtle, mm-hmm. some kind of radioactive or something. Okay. He bought it in store and he grew up to be fucking like the size of Godzilla. <laughs> <laughs> Honest to God, yeah. and they f- he fly, uh-huh. and he helping people. This so if he play this music, tira 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 tira, that's turtle here, and then he's coming and has helping. But if what is this this fucking music, turtle? <laughs> Honest to God, I want to play this music that tira tira tira, so people know what I'm talking. But we about. can't play music. What kind of bo- oh you wrong with this? Because the fucking guys. Now, every each one, remember how before they say, oh, I can put radio? Now everybody put radio. Mm-hmm. They test the cars and everything. And they say, look, we're going to test this system. And the fucking uh, song's playing like more than two minutes. Yeah. So how come he can play normal radio from the car? And they say song, Taylor Swift, and fucking it's going. Uh-huh. Well, uh, that's... I their... think so something changed. You didn't check. No, I prefer no music. No music, that means no problems. Yeah, but sometimes it will be nice if you use it like, 
no longer 10 seconds, something to showing what we want. No, because as, as soon as you put someone else's music, they can like basically own your video on YouTube, and then you get nothing. Goes to them. Oh, yeah, I think it's too overacting. Because I said, I was surprised how you said, and the guy testing fucking, this is the guy one testing all Cardi likes fucking surround sound. Yeah. And he play fucking music and we listen. That's awesome. This is a talk show where we fucking talk. Has nothing to do with music. Yeah, but we post it on YouTube. Fuck the music. Why? Sing. 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 <laughs> Sing. <laughs> Sing. <laughs> Fucking retard. Yeah, yeah. I yeah, watch yeah. fucking idiots driving all day, <laughs> listening to the radio. <laughs> when I can do the same thing five minutes away. I know. Okay, the government could pass the law as early as the summer, despite the potential change of the age of consent. An exception will still exist for intercourse between people who are at least 13 and who have an age gap of less than five years. What about China? Consent in China. I think the China's more strict. Because you can even have two kids over there. <laughs> <laughs> now they say you, they want you have two kids. Age of consent in China is 14. Oh my God! I was thinking fucking in Poland is 18. So we're like really old. Yeah, because you guys are retarded. No, I think so. This guy's retarded. How you can fucking rape 13 years old? The fuck? age of consent in Poland is 15. What? Yeah. Now? Yeah, it's been like that the whole time. No, it wasn't. 18. It says here, the legal age for sexual consent in Poland is 15 years old. It says here that anyone who has sexual intercourse with a minor under the age of 15 or commits any other sexual act or coercion him or her submit to or perform such an act is liable to imprisonment for 2 to 12 years only. Only 12 years? <laughs> no, you could get even 2 years. No, no, but 12? 2 to 12, yeah. Oh, if I, what does this, what does this mean? Like... Uh, why are you going for 12? Why are you going for 2? Maybe they do it by a younger, you get more. <laughs> <laughs> they go, you fuck 9 year old, to you fucking 12 years. Or maybe you do it second time, then they get... Can... Yeah, third time you're out! <laughs> no fucking! No, but that's crazy. How much uh, consent in Germany? Holy shit, I just read it. No, Poland, uh, Germany. I did read Germany, it was 14, I think. Oh yeah, what about the... Uh... Holy Thailand. Fuck. I'm gonna go every fucking country. Thailand. No, no. Thailand. Care. Let's go to Thailand. Let's see Thailand. Let's learn about the country. It's 15 as well. Oh. And ten, the same thing? 12 years? You go to the job? Because I, I have to send you a package? <laughs> it says here the age of consent for both boys and girls is 15. The Thai Penal Code. Thai Penal Code. <laughs> okay. Also provides for close in age exemptions. In case of a child below 18 has sexual intercourse with another child 13 to 15. Mm -hmm. So they have a loophole. If you're 18, you can fuck a 13 year old. They say that's okay. That's what I'm Because of the age gap. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. But that's like... You, you guy 25 can't fuck 13. Yeah, but this is like... They have these... They have math loopholes, it seems like. I miscalculate. Sorry, Mr. Policeman. Uh, 12 years. Goodbye. Yeah. Crazy. That's crazy. I think so it's too young. You should be like 18. They, they're they changing it. It was even younger. It was younger in France. It was younger in... Oh, France was younger. They changed. They just changed no, it No, I think so you're wrong. Everyone was 18 before, how I was leaving. No. Yeah. We, you couldn't do shit fucking even 16. That, I think so there's something changed. Fuck, all your phone is fucked. There's nothing fucked. I'm just reading what it is. Yeah, I think so that what you're reading is bullshit information. Fake news. Speaking of fake, we got a fake Indian officer 
who conned his way into top meetings. What? Indian information guy? Who called fake... Fake, fake Indian officer. What, what kind of officer? It doesn't matter. It's fake. No, like a he's police no officer. officer. He's what? just an officer. <laughs> <laughs> I explode with juicy fucking speech. Fucking, I'm like, holy fuck. This only officer. But what kind of officer? Yeah, Indian. I never forget. A okay. wireless security guy. Mm-hmm. In casino. Mm-hmm. And I was driving golf cart. Okay. And then, then I go on the roof. And I see big biker pee in the corner. Okay. So that was... I say, hey, what the fuck? I say, oh, oh, sorry, officer. I'm like, oh, officer. I'm like, are you pee like this at home? <laughs> no, I'm so sorry. I have to go. I didn't know. The guy's like, fuck it. He can fucking rip my head with fucking one hand. Mm-hmm. Huge guy. And he's like, Mr. Officer. I'm like, stop it. It's the last time. Mm-hmm. With my golf cart, then the guy fucking was so scary. Or I gonna kick you out without? Oh, I said this. Or I gonna kick you out without reference from hotel? He was in casino hotel. Mm-hmm. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I really have to go. I'm like, are you pee? Like the best is like this. Are you pee like this at home in mommy corner house? Mm-hmm. No. But that was hilarious how I was. <laughs> <laughs> Laziness, hundred yeah. percent. Zeus is like this. I'm booging on a condo. Right? Yeah. <laughs> it says, okay. Indian police yes. have arrested a man. Oh, Indian police officer for posing as a senior officer from Prime Minister Narendra Modi's office. Oh, so he was like a government uh, uh, officer, like I was, Minister of Defense, mm-hmm. or. GR, the government, uh, uh, you know, like, <laughs> <Retards. all> the <laughs> and then and, and then and then he say I'm this this, and they said they found it, and he is not there, so he exposed exposed no impose impose officer lying to people that he is government officer from Minister of Defense. So it's all Sung Pong Tong. Yeah, it says here he was on a visit to the Kashmir Valley. Kashmir um, Valley? Yeah, that's where they make Kashmir. Kashmir is in India. Listen, the Kashmir is like a. Kashmir is a material. Yeah, I know. The Kashmir is like the same one as the. It's very. Swave. It's very soft. Yeah, that's what I put to the. Like pillar in the escalate. The swell. Say, swave. I have this material about it. That's the Kashmir? Kashmir is what? What is Swave and what is Kashmir? What is the difference? Okay, so... Okay. Is that... Kashmir wool yeah. is a fiber. Yeah, what is Swave? It's manufactured in Mongolia, Nepal, and in Kashmir, like the city Kashmir in India, for thousands of years. Yeah, yeah they have this fucking, you know, like... Uh, the. Caterpillars who make this fucking thing. That's silk. silk. Yeah. That's not cashmere. Oh, what is cashmere? Show me the cashmere. I love it. It looks like this. Like you make like the cashmere. Put a picture. Of See, it says cashmere wool, usually simply known as cashmere, is a fiber obtained from cashmere goats. <laughs> 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 it, yeah, it's a blanket made out of goats. Okay. So yeah, what is sweat? Pa- pash- Pashamen goats? Or Anka? Or some other breed of goat. Yeah. But either is... way, it's goats. Okay, what is Ankatara? You want to see what a cashmere goat looks like? This is a cashmere oh, goat. Oh, that's the... So they make beautiful blankets. Yeah, yeah, them. but the cashmere goats... See, so look at them nice. Yeah, yeah, but what is different between cashmere Be- and... Beautiful. And... <laughs> <laughs> uh, Ankatara, Ankatara. Goat. What? Who's Ankatara? Kashmir and Ankatara, what is different? What the fuck are you saying? What's that? Ankatera? What the fuck is that? You know, like, this is this look like a sway fucking in the cars now. They use it. So it's never hot in this. They use it for all fucking uh, steering wheels and everything now. Because it can be hot and can be cold. Ankatera. 
Ankatara. This is what I got. A fictional character, Katara. No, Katara. Ankatara. You say... I said what you just said. No. Ankatara. Swave. Put Swave. What is Swave? Swave. It's, uh, I got Shockwave and Medicine stocks. No, you have to put full... In, like the Swave in the car. Say, like, full uh, sentence so they can pick it up. Did you have a swave in a car? Oh, it's suave. Swave. Material. See? It's the same. Looking. Yeah. So what is different between cashmere and this? That's a good question. I'm trying to find that out right now. Yeah, because I have suede material. I, I, because I, I use this for this, like one, one pillar, and I'm supposed to do second, and it never happened. Maybe I do them tomorrow. It's another one. I think I'm still spelling it wrong. Yeah, but I see it in the picture. I know, but it's not giving me like a full answer. I feel like I'm still spelling it. But it goes swift in a car. It uses in the car. See, like swift seats with the steering wheels. You should say swift in the car pictures. And then it's going to jump run away to the pictures. Mm-hmm. You got it? I give up. I don't know how to spell it. Oh. I don't know how to spell it. I just spelt it three different ways and it's just I'm not getting it. But anyways, police has charged... Yeah, I have this material, what I'm doing. That's right. Yeah. What I did my... Uh, but does it have a label on it? Where it's no, made, I bought it. How it's made? No. How it's spelt? See, touch. See, it's like... Yeah. This one. Mm -hmm. So that's what I did, pillar. And I have this. I bought it this. Like, I want to do all pillars and everything. I learned how to do it. Now it's a piece of cake. But I can make time. Uh. It just... So anyway, that was... So the police have charged this man about this wave? with cheating, imp Dujo, impersonation, and forgery. Yeah, the officer. Yeah. How they find out he's a crook? It said a police complaint filed against him said that the man was trying to secure monetary and material benefits. It said the man arrested came to light on Thursday when he was... Uh, produced in court. It said he has he has a verified Twitter account and counts an if, official of the ruling Bharatiya Janata Party, the BJP party, among his followers. So the guy had a full fake persona of being an officer in India for a high-profile politician, mm -hmm. even to a point where they had him verified that, yes, he is a political officer in India. It says here, according to the PTI on one visit, that the man claimed he had been asked by the government to identify buyers for apple orchards in South Kashmir. Kashmir? I s yeah. That's what that's how we ended up with the fucking conversation. No, but the, no. fucking retard. Kash now you're talking like we we didn't just talk about cashmere for ten minutes. No, we talk about cashmere, but we find out it's from goat. Yeah, at least you remembered it's from goats. <laughs> and he said, "Officer, goat." The guy's like, "You have nice goats. You have to uh, make sure the cashmere is uh, okay." 
It says here another visit. He traveled to a popular skiing destination, and he won everything for free. Gol Golmarg. Golguda. And claimed that the government had asked him to look into improvement of the hotel facilities in the area. Oh, no problem. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to sleep in the Let me check today. your spa. Yeah, let me check out. your food. Bring me food. Come on. Can I hug the fucking flamingo? <laughs> it says here, court documents revealed security official... Does the media everything? Yes. Found forged identity cards in his possession. Forged? Oh, so they find fake Fake, guys and, fake cards. Whatever. And then this guy was going around India saying, I'm the chief of, of the political police. I need to check. You, can, you, you can't believe it how you can fool everybody before. Yeah. Like I was pretending I was somebody else. Make my friend going from army for holiday. Mm -hmm. I call from Warsaw pretending I'm my general. Mm -hmm. And I, I know how he speak. And I speak his language and say, hey, this is a so-and-so from... Minister of Defense, say, hi, uh, hey, what's up? Can I speak with uh, so and so? And he said, yeah, just a second. And it's like a lieutenant so and so. I say, listen, my my nephew is inside your fucking. Thing. Can you give him like a fucking, you know, like a, a pass for forty eight hours so I can see him? Yeah, no problem. Mm -hmm. And fuck, we pick him up. And it was not possible he go to home about this time. But we, I made it this because I called like. Pretend. I use really names, so how they check this this guy over there. Mm -hmm. And on the weekends they always at home, so they can't directly call them. Yeah. So that's what I was saying. I'm saying, okay, I'm coming back to the uh, my CD. Can you release him for 48 hours so I can just uh, talk to him and this? And saying yeah, no problem. And he he can't believe it still how he was jumping. We have his girlfriend with us. And she's, we drive, pick him up with a taxi, and mm -hmm. he couldn't believe it. He like this, he came in with a uniform and said, how? How is this possible? Don't worry about it. Peter makes it up. Because <laughs> I visit home, and I, 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 I can visit every fucking weekend. I was driving train, eight hours, like you said, I don't know, trains. But mm -hmm. I was every fucking eight hours going on and going back. Going on, going back. But that was like... That's what, like I said, if you know how to talk, before was no internet, they couldn't check it, forget about it. Mm -hmm. This is one guy was talking uh, how he opened fucking uh, doctor office. <laughs> we, he never was that. <laughs> he said before, nobody checked, so he made the stamp with the number, fake number, step, mm -hmm. and he even tested the step. He made prescription, put himself, mm -hmm. his stamp, mm -hmm. went, take a prescription, <laughs> take the drugs out. Mm -hmm. That's what there was, was so funny before, like, you know, no check, nobody was checking you before. Mm -hmm. Now it's like, you know, and you're right there. Mm -hmm. And even sometimes popping you like you have a warrant. Yeah. And you're like, that's not me. And there's another guy who you still... Yeah, how can it be like, we need to get back to the old days where the cops just show up at your work and arrest you. What? You know how some people, they don't hire people if they have a warrant or something? But back in the day, like, the cops would just show up at your work and take you. Mm -hmm. That happens in kitchens all the time. Your kitchen will get arrested all the time? Yeah, I've heard of guys, like, kitchen workers, like, the cops just come in and grab them and put them in handcuffs and take them. In the middle of the shift. Oh, because they, like, uh... They did something fucked up. Yeah, yeah. Like went to Japan and ate a tortoise or something. I don't know. He, he borrowed the owl and never give back. Yeah. You have outstanding fucking fees. Yeah. For, he didn't pay. For the owl rental. Yeah, seven billion dollars. Yeah. All right, final story. You ready? Yeah, fuck. I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> Uttar Pradesh. Oh, fuck me. Can you Is say it? this one more time? Uttar Pradesh. Arthur Pradesh? Yeah. Okay. It's a, like a place in India. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Fuck, what okay. are we stuck with India? Eight, eight killed by del deluge of potatoes after roof collapse. What happened? A bunch of potatoes fell. No, but what'd you say? <laughs> Atur Puluj. That's the person? Yeah, that's the place. Oh, the place. Eight people were killed. Oh, eight people was killed. By a deluge 
A deluge or deluge of potatoes. Deluge of potatoes. After a roof collapsed. So how this deluge potatoes was on the roof? So basically they had a big pile of potatoes, like 50 pound bag potatoes. Hundreds of bags of them. On the roof? On the roof. Why on the roof? And then the roof collapsed. Yeah, yeah. And then they got crushed by hundreds of pounds of potatoes and killed them. But they in the bags, no? Or was Yeah, those... they're in bags. They fucking smacked Or maybe you. they put like in a big fucking crate over there and then after get loose and then... It says here at least eight people have died after a ro- the roof of a storage facility packaged with huge sacks of potatoes collapsed in Sambal. A city in the northeast Indian state of Uttar Pradesh. Yeah, People were buried underneath heaps of potatoes and debris from the building. And videos showed rescue, rescuers searching for the survivors in the potatoes. Yeah, yeah, because the India is crazy. You know, like the cars have like, even train, the people sitting on the roof. How many potatoes do you have to have to kill eight people? That's well, a lot of be, potatoes. No, they're, they're heavy. Even they like fucking, let's say, bags of like 10 kilos or something. Well, and usually like most... Like, in in our country, we have bags of fucking 100 kilo potatoes, bags. No, you can't buy 100 kilos. No, we have. The biggest you We're can... loading trucks and fucking with no. 100 dollars. Big load like what the... trucks? You don't fucking load nothing with potatoes, you fucking liar. The mm. fuck are you talking what about? What are you talking about? How you're moving potatoes to the stores... You have the bags like the dog bags, mm. fucking yeah, huge. Yeah, the biggest you could do is 50 pounds. That's a lot. Who said that? You can't package shit bigger than 50 pounds. No, that's more than 50. No. <laughs> yeah, <so> stop. <laughs> stop. Yeah. 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 Stop. Yeah. stop it. We love you. Yeah. I don't know. What's up? Yeah, you big larva. I think so. He's hungry. He's hungry? Yeah, he's definitely... Yes, that's showing. But yeah, a bunch of Indians got crushed by potatoes at oh work. Oh my god. You Imagine that's how you die, you get a phone call. Bring. Hello. This uh, is hello, a... Mr. Uh, you should go, go do No, about... potatoes is heavy. Your uh, husband died today at work. Oh my god, what happened? Well, the, ce- by the ceiling wasn't enforced well enough. Mm. And the, the, all the potatoes fell on him and he got Yeah, in India, everything is by fucking potatoes. overloaded with everything. Fucking everywhere as you see some bullshit, you know, like fucking million shit everywhere. There, Hanging, there is shit everywhere They fucking was showing the guy drive scooter with fucking cow on the back. <laughs> with a cow on the back. Yeah, it was like ridiculous fucking shit. Uh-huh. They use the scooters for everything. They're towing fucking trains with the scooters. <laughs> oh, this is a funny story. Oh, another story? Yeah, <laughs> one more quick. Because oh, I, I just noticed this. This is, uh, this is funny to me. Eye drops recalled in U.S. following blindness and injuries. Oh, my God. <laughs> the eye drops were making people blind. So kind of over, let's say... Expired date and they change to the acid or something. It says U.S. health officials say that eye drops may have killed one person and several injured, several others due to drug resistant bacteria contamination. Mm-hmm. It says here the CDC uh, have identified 68 patients across 16 states with a rare strain of Fies. Dominus Aragunan. Show me the name. Show me the name because they're you killing. No, no, no. I'm uh, the strain <laughs> had never been found in the U.S. before this latest outbreak. In addition to the one death in eight patients that have severe vision loss, four have had eyes surgically removed because of these eye drops. They removed their eyes. They said, listen, you don't need these anymore. <laughs> you know why they removed their eyes, huh? So there's no proof. What? <laughs> no, the eyes is an extension of the brain. So if you're just fucking eating your eyes, you can even die from to the brain. That's why they remove eyes from yeah. you, cutting off. It says here, most of the patients diagnosed with this infection reported using eye drops and artificial... Artificial tears. Didn't know you could buy artificial tears. <laughs> it says 10 different brands were initially identified as possible linked 
to the outbreak, the CDC said. Eye drops that are made in India and imported to the U.S. under two brands were subsequently pulled from the shelves in January and February. So it says here, open bottles taken from patients were found through testing to contain the bacteria, the CDC said. Unopened bottles are currently being tested to determine whether contamination occurred during the manufacturing process. Crazy. Fucking... Imagine that you like I buy eye drops to make my eyes feel better, and then you wake up your. Whoa, well, whoa! Well, what is this make in India? No, I just buy potatoes from India. It says here that eye drops and eye wash products were used by approximately 117 million Americans in 2020, according to Statista, a market research firm. Statista. So they can have an outbreak of blindness. And Mr. Beast just cured blindness, and now they're going to have more blindness. It's unbelievable. Yeah. They're From probably eye got, drops. Probably this total of fucking 100 eye drops. They, they put the eye drops and he blind them. Yeah. And what he can smell too? He have COVID. <laughs> the oldest turtle. The, yeah, he have COVID. The 190 year old Yeah, he have COVID. He's blind from he, fucking India. He can't see and smell, but he can hear. Yeah, very good. Yeah. The, what his name was? They're like, warmer, Jonathan. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> All right, and that's it. All right, the peace and love. Peace on to the next fucking show. Yeah, goodbye. <laughs> peace <laughs> and love, peace and love. What's up? <laughs> That's it. <laughs>